Nick Gonzalez, Applied Vision Works, uh, on the blog once again. I want to talk today uh, really quickly about taking a look at other people's perspective. And the way that I'm going to do this is, is by really redefining what common sense is. So let me tell you a story uh, that happened to me, and I've ran this story a million times over my head because it actually happened to me when I was in college. So one of uh, my good friends and I were at the bookstore, and we were in line. This is back when we used to write checks. So I was up. Uh, my bill for my books was about 200 bucks. I wrote a check for $200, turned to my friend and said, hey, it's going to be a tough week because I've only got $50 in my account for the whole week. So my friend grabbed my checkbook and said, no, actually, you've got a lot of money. And I said, how do you figure? He said, look how many checks you still have. So my friend had actually thought that how much money in my bank account depended on how many checks I had. So when I was in college, I just thought maybe he didn't, he lacked some common sense or, or just was lacked some intelligence. But I didn't take a minute to step into his perspective. And so let me redefine what common sense is. So common sense to me, I used to think was just everybody had this bank of knowledge that you were supposed to know and it made you street smart or that you had common sense. But what common sense actually is, is it's a series of our experiences that shape what to us is common sense. So if I go back to the story, it wasn't that my friend lacked common sense. It was just that the way that he was raised and the way that his parents had brought him up was that his experiences said, as long as I had checks, there was still money in my account. That was a series of experiences that he had. So the challenge that I have for everybody is, when's the last time you look, maybe look down on somebody because you thought they had lack of common sense, and instead, and take that situation through and actually step back and look at it in their perspective and their series of common, or their series of common sense and their series of experiences.